Hi guys, yeah, uh, my name's Richard Atkinson. Um, I've been sending out emails um, to website owners uh, regarding becoming a publisher on Zooclad Network, um, and I've had quite a bit of, I've had quite a few questions um, emailed back to me, and a lot of them just asking for more info, really. Um, so I thought the easiest thing to do was probably put a little video together, just explaining what it is. Um, and just to run you through the process of, of becoming a publisher on ZooCloud Network. Okay, so you're going to click. What, what, what you're going to do is you're going to click on the um, on this video. There'll be a link, um, and some of the email the, the emails I've sent out there'll be a there'll be a, um, there'll be my link on there as well. So you can click on there, and it brings you bring you to this page. Okay, what you need to do is fill out this page, and on this drop down menu here, you need to click on publisher okay so once we've done that we're then registered as a publisher and we can go into the main site so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into my account profile and just make sure everything's right in there just fill your profile profile out as it should be just make sure everything's um everything's right and the first thing, the second thing we're going to do is we're going to go to my websites. So my websites here. We're going to click on create new. Now the idea of this is basically you're going to put your website into here. Um, if you if you've got free space on your website, this is just fantastic because you can put text ads, banner ads on your website. Um, once it's approved on here um, and basically when people click on the ads you get paid it's as simple as that it's completely free um, and you can you can place as many ads as you want on your website it's, it's free there's no limit um, it's just fantastic um, so what you do is you click on um, I'll just show you again you click on create new go to here you're going to put in your website in there you're going to put, sorry, you're not going to put your website in there. You're going to put your website in, in there. The name of your website goes in the top bar. So uh, I'm just, for instance, I'll just type Richard Atkinson. Then you want to need to, that's just a, a little description of your website, what it is, um, you know, just, just if you're selling or what, what is your website, what it, what it does website tags so you need to put in there um, what keywords basically so if it's a rev share make money from home just keywords linked to your website and um, so you just write what you do is you just put in there so say for instance um, I just write money and then you put comma next one comma next one comma so that's easy enough in here, just ask if there's any other content. You just put no. Language. What language is your website? So is it, you've got a number of choices here. I'm just gonna put English. Add location. Where do you want the ad to appear on your website? So you can have it anyway, any, in any way you like, um, but I'm gonna put in here, home page in there any restrictions um, so gambling um, you, know, you might not want gambling in there again adult content that type of thing so you can just just put in there anything um, that you, 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 you restrictions um, that's basically you know you don't want ads you don't want ads on your website um, gambling or adult content okay um the age group so the age group of your of your website users so we'll just click on on one of them i want to go all ages your gender so is it mixed is it more female is it um is it hair products so you is it more female is it male um i don't know is it to do with um health and fitness um well, it could be mixed um so i'm just going to say mixed on here this is you look um 
where does you where does most where does most of your website users come from? So where does most of your traffic come from? Um, is it worldwide? Is it Europe? Um, just put in I'm just going to put there worldwide, and then you're going to click OK. Okay, I'm not going to do that because um, once that's done, it will approve. It will go into pending. Sorry, it will go into pending. And if it pass if it passes approval, it will go into approval. Or if it doesn't, it'll go and rejected. Okay. If it goes and rejected, you need to review it and then resubmit it. Okay. So on here, what will happen is it'll come up here. There'll be a little round. There'll be a circle there with a pause button in it. You need to click the pause button to play. Okay. That activates the website. Okay. So the second thing we're going to do is my ad zone. So these are your ad zones. Create new. So what type of ad do you want on your website? Text ad, image ad, I'm going to go for an image ad. You're going to click on here. It's going to drop down. It's going to, all your websites that have been approved will be listed here. And you pick the one you want, the, want it to go on to. Okay. You're going to click a category. You're going to click category on there for your advertisement, for your, or for your, for your banner. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to select all. Okay. Add zone name. So you can put an add zone name in there. Add placement URL. So you're going to put the URL of the website where you want it placed. You're going to click your banner size. So I'm going to go for a 468 by 60. It's an ad, the ad type, which is going to be paid per click. Okay, I'm going to set the set this here. Um, now it recommends between one and 18, 18, 18 cents per click, depending where your website is, depending on how much traffic your website gets. Um, you know that's going to depend on what. Obviously, this will be reviewed, and if you, if your price is 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 way over. Um, then obviously the, then the, that'll be sorted accordingly, but it just depends how much website how traffic you get. Um, if it's a good website that, that you get a lot of traffic, then I'm sure there'll be no reason why you don't get a, a I don't know something like I mean a reasonable kind of price is probably something like that. Um, so this is here. This is your maximum ads, uh, your max number of ads. So every time the page refreshes, how many different ads do you want to come up on your page? So we're going to say five. I don't think you want too many. Okay. Um, when people are looking at ads, they might want to see it again. And when it's refreshed, it, they, they, there might be different ads. So they don't want to be, it, I think you just maybe five, clicking round, uh, rotating round is, is about right. Minimum spend. Okay. The minimum spend. Minimum spend is on here um pay, get paid for duration so you could have um you could have somebody that just wants to pay for your ad space only so you only have one ad all the time and someone look some advertiser will pay for that for that position so this here is what's the minimum you would accept so i'm going to say 0 0.5 in there okay so once that's filled in you're going to click ok again it'll go into pending if it's rejected it'll go back in there you need to resubmit it once you've sorted it out or it'll go into approval again it'll come up under here and it'll say paused click on the play button and that will activate it okay now you can do as many of these these um, ad, ads here as you want, okay? So you can create as many as well. So you can do banner ads, you can do text ads. You can do as many as you want, okay? And it's free. <clears throat> then what you're gonna do, the next step, you're gonna go to generate code. So you're gonna go into here, and you're gonna website name so you're going to click on here and it's going to bring up your your websites that have been approved you're going to click on the website you want you're going to click on here 
which is going to give you the ad placement that you've so it's a text ad or um text ad or uh, an image ad and it'll be displayed in here it'll be dropped down if there's more than one and you can pick which one you want add layout so this here basically you will see this one one when if you fill this and this in then it'll display an ad here it'll well, actually display an ad here and it'll show you how big it is and how much space it's going to take up on your website okay right this is your code so this is your html code so basically you need to copy that code obviously you need access to your website html you need to cut paste this into your website where you want this to be yeah so paste that in and basically that is it you've pasted that in as long as everything's active so if we go back to um, ad zones what's going to happen is here on ad zones what's going to happen is there's going to be a little light a little green and red dot here now if that's on red that means it's not active now if that isn't active then obviously you're not going to get any money from your from from the clicks on your website so you need to make sure that um so say for instance if you if you took the html code on, on your website then this then this would go red and it wouldn't be working okay so it's important that that that, that, that all you know everything's all synchronized and all together and working okay um i mean this is this is a great opportunity and, and if you've got a website with a bit of free space on it why not put an ad um and you're going to make money you're going to make money from from people clicking on there um you know and um yeah so that's great i hope this has been helpful um if you follow the say if you click on the link under this video that'll take you to my to the to the registration page um register as a as a publisher and just follow these steps um and, and start making some money uh, once your websites are approved you know it's great and like i say make as many ads as you want and get them placed on your website or websites um yeah so okay there's i hope this has helped you anyway i just thought it'd be the easiest way of, of coming back with the information and uh, i shall speak soon thank you very much bye bye now